Yo, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to a brand new video. Today's video is gonna be more of a vlog style video. We got Butters in the cut. What's good, Butters? What you gotta say to the people? Tell them like, comment, and subscribe. Let's get Butters a treat. All right, Butters, come here. Sit. Good. Paw. Good. Lay down. Good. Speak. Speak. Good. Wait. Okay. Just a little background story. I was chilling at home. I got a random knock on my door and a package arrived. I wasn't expecting anything cause I didn't order anything. I was wondering what arrived at my door. What could it possibly be? I looked at the label and it said goat on it. Now immediately what first came to my mind was one of the bids that I placed a long time ago finally got accepted and I ended up buying a pair that I ended up bidding on. But to my surprise, that wasn't the case. Goat sent over the what the ducks and surprised me with this crazy gift. So I wanted to go ahead and make this video to show you guys everything in detail. So let's get right to it. Starting off with the card that they gave me. It says, Alex, in collaboration with Division Street, Goat is excited to debut the What The Ducks, a tribute to the legendary What The Dunks with details inspired by the Oregon football jerseys. We hope you enjoy these special sneakers ahead of their official release date on October 11th, your friends at GOAT. So first things first, I wanna give a huge shout out to GOAT. This is insane. I haven't done a partnership with GOAT in years. I wanna say over three years, I haven't partnered with them with anything and they kept my information. They kept my actual shoe size because sometimes when you get gifts, it's not the right size, but they kept everything. Like they had my file on deck and they went ahead and blessed me. So that's amazing. I really appreciate it. Shout out to you guys also. If you guys didn't watch the videos and you weren't tuning in regularly, this would not be possible. So thank you guys. I really appreciate it. But let's go ahead and talk about the shoes. These are going to be releasing tomorrow on the 11th on the GOAT app. So I will have the info on all the releases and all that stuff down below in the description. Now I'm gonna be honest, before these arrived, I didn't even hear about them coming out. I didn't know what they were when I opened the box. I was like, yo, what's going on? Like, what are these? And then I went ahead, read up, and I watched a couple videos. Shout out to Jacques Slade for making an amazing review video. I'll also have the link down below in the description. But let's go ahead and talk about the shoes, give my overall opinions, and then tell you why this shoe is amazing. Obviously, this is a more hyped release, but I don't really wanna get too into it. There was already craziness last week with the Flight Club release, if I'm not mistaken. Um, there's 5,000 pairs. The Nike SB Tiffany's were around 4,000 pairs, if I'm not mistaken, so that's pretty crazy. But let's go ahead and talk about what makes this sneaker cool, and let me give you guys a close up look in 4K. Quick shout out to Sneaker Bar Detroit for the information. I am going to be reading this just so I get all the information correct. So shout out to Sneaker Bar Detroit. Retail price is $275. And if you guys are interested in buying this pair, I will have a link down below in the description to GOAT. And once again, shout out to GOAT for sending these over. Now let's go ahead and set the hype aside and talk about the real benefit of these sneakers. The proceeds from the sales will go to the Division Street Fund, which aids student athletes from the University of Oregon. Whenever you talk about any What The series, you know that every panel is going to be different. There's gonna be a variety of materials, variety of finishes. And I gotta say, it's not easy to put a shoe together that has so many mismatched panels and make it still look uniform at the same time. So that's what I really like about the What The series. Now for this particular release, they took bits and pieces from classic Oregon uniforms and they went ahead and threw it on the shoe. And like with any What The Dunk series, they're not gonna be the same shoes. So that's what I love about it. Soles are different, swooshes are different, but they look very uniform at the same time. It's amazing how they do this stuff. So let's go ahead and just take a look at the shoe, the overall build and everything like that. I'm actually surprised that GOAT still has my information. They got the size perfectly, they had the address and all that good stuff. So this is freaking sick, dude. We have a neon green midsole that peeks through the bottom of the shoe. The back says ducks of a feather right there. 
That chrome goes kind of crazy though. Pink swoosh with the extra hit of detail in there. And the materials on these things is super nice. It's very soft, nice and buttery. And I like the extra touch of embroidery right here. And speaking of extra touches, we also got some laces. We got some lace options here, three to be exact. I know some people were thinking that these are Nike SBs, but I think these are just normal dunks. This is just a normal dunk tongue right here. 24 on the inside, what the? On this side, we got ducks of a feather stamped up. Again, that 24. We got the duck logo in there looking extra spicy. And oh, look at how they did this. Interesting. Again, I think it's always amazing when the sneaker community could come together to make a positive change, especially in a business where it's a lot of take, take, take. It's cool to see Nike kind of getting the public to participate in a not so obvious way. Of course, they're gonna hit us with the limited stuff and all that, but what a lot of people don't understand that is by buying these shoes, you're actually helping out a lot of the student athletes. So that's the main message at the end of the day. And you're doing it while getting a sick pair of sneakers as well. And since this is more of a vlog style video, I wanted to show you guys another package that I got in today. This is from Sneaker Law. They went ahead and made a sneaker head book. So it has all the stuff sneaker related in here. I will have a link to where you could buy this in the description down below. But one cool thing is the book marker is a freaking shoelace. I gotta show you guys this real quick. Do you guys remember these days? The Galaxy pack right there. You got the Kobe's, LeBron's, the foam posits, the KD's. I'm not a big fan of reading. I'm gonna be honest. I'm not a big fan of reading, but this is something that I will for sure read. On this page, it features some of the sneaker YouTubers. Your boy made it right there on page 372. So huge shout out to everybody. If you see any of your uh, favorite sneaker YouTubers, Make sure you shout them out, let them know that they're in a book, which is pretty legendary. I never thought that I would be uh, in a book or make a feature in a book, but hey, we made it. This video might seem a little rushed because I am getting ready to go to the game tonight. This is going to be my first hockey game ever at the, uh, what's the place called? The Sap Center. I'm rolling in with God Frenchy, Daniel Liu, David Got Kicks. So I might be able to vlog that, I'm not sure, but I'm gonna go ahead and end this video right here. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. Again, huge shout out to GOAT. Good luck to everybody that wants a pair tomorrow. It's going to be insane, but the links are down below in the description if you guys want to read up on it a little bit more. But I'll see you guys very soon for the next video. It's your boy Sneakerhead in the Bay. I'm out. Peace. Shoot.